Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you don't know who I am, my name is Reese. This is my beauty channel where we come to slay, especially on a budget. And if you're new, don't forget to hit that red button down below and turn on your post notifications. As you can see, I got a new bombshell unit. This hair is brought to you by Beauty Forever. So of course, I'm gonna show you what's inside the box, how I customize this wig, and also a review and install process. So if that's something you're interested in, then keep on watching. Bye. Lacey, do you think you overdid it with our hair? Uh-uh. Nope. I sure don't. Cause we going to Beverly Hills. Now if I'ma do good at that audition, we got to look like stars. So in this box, I got a goodie bag that received a wig, earrings, eyelashes, and then of course this unit is a 24 inch pre-plucked brown hair balayage, 13 by four lace wig. It is a water wave pre-colored at 150% density. So before we bleach this unit, I like to get my blast free spray and put that on the hairline and comb the little hairs back so it can be out the way and that I don't over bleach this unit. I do use BW2 and 40 volume developer and then I mix that up and create a nice thick consistency. Then with a plastic knife, just go ahead and spread the bleach all throughout the frontal. Make sure it's a nice and smooth uh, uh, application process. If you do get bleach on the unit or the hair itself, get some alcohol wipes and just rub the bleach off from the hair. Once you're finished, I like to wait about 15 to 30 minutes. Just double check the knots and wash it out with purple conditioner. So here I'm taking the even 24 hour anti-itch scalp treatment. It is tea tree oil. I put that in between my twists to basically help my scalp not itch while I wear my wigs. I take some gel and put that on my edges and just comb that back. I do not sew my braids up. So what I like to do is just put a wig cap over just to hold my braids up and my braids won't poke out of the wig while I'm wearing my unit. I take an alcohol wipe and I just clean up the excess gel so make sure your skin is cleaned off before doing the ball cap method. I like to use pantyhose for the ball cap method because it gives that very seamless look instead of it being super thick. I cut the ears off and I, I use my blast free spray and just spray that on my hairline. I do not use glue because I am trying to save my edges y'all. So here once it is dried up after like 10 minutes I just cut off the excess cap and then I like to use you know clean up the surface again and then my concealer from my beauty supply store I just put that on my cap. And that's how you create that ball cap method. I take the same concealer and put that on my unit as well. So here's what it looks like inside this unit. It was an already pre-made middle part and it was pre-plucked so I did not pluck this unit whatsoever. So I'm just going to let you guys vibe out and I'm going to give you a review while I'm installing this wig. So overall for the pros, I just love water wave in general. Water wave textures is the easiest type of texture to maintain on your hair because all you can do is just wake up and just head out the door. It's as easy as wearing braids to be honest. It gives you that summer look. I love the messy wavy look it's just perfect for the summer i love the color i love the quality of the hair i can tell that's gonna last a while so some more pros <laughs> i love the lace itself is very soft so for my sensitive skin girls this lace is perfect for you 
Now heading on to the cons, I wish the density was more thicker, so it is 150%. If it was 180 and more, I feel like the unit would last maybe four or five more months. But since it's very thin, I feel like it won't last as long. It does not shed or tangle, so maybe it still will last for up to four months. But another con that I do have is that I wish there was more lace around the ear. This could, this lace wig fit me perfectly. I am a medium cap size head and it fits me perfectly, but it might not fit perfectly for other mediums. So I wish it was just a little bit more room, wiggle room around the ear area so it can fit majority of medium size heads. So definitely buy a size up if you think that um, you're more of a larger size, you know? The shipping was about a week, so if you're looking for a unit with bomb quality hair and just ships at a faster rate, definitely check out Beauty Forever. I remember I used to buy Beauty Forever hair when I was growing up, so it's super cool that I'm able to work with them. Here I'm just testing out how much the hair sheds and tangles. As you can see, that's how much hair that throughout the whole head that I lost, which is really, really good. And how that comb was just going through without no snags. So here I'm just cleaning up my hairline. I put a little bit too much spray. Of course, you can just cover that with some of that concealer and some foundation powder and it will just look very seamless. Definitely check out my fluffy baby hair tutorial. I go into depth about how I create these baby hairs, but of course, the baby hair tutorials in every single one of my videos ever since I invested in this pencil flat iron it has changed the baby hair game but that's basically it for my install method y'all thank you so much for supporting this channel comment down below a crown if you made it this far this is the final result of this hair. I just love Water Wave on me. It just gives me that beachy summer vibe. And then the brown color just goes so well on my skin. I want to thank you, Beauty Forever Hair, for letting me try out this unit. Don't forget, you guys, to like, comment, and subscribe for more videos. And I'll be seeing you in my next video. Bye! Meditating and taking time away You always